Anna and Lena are here. We are in Alameda Gardens today, having a nice walk because the weather is uh, lovely, nice and warm. Well, nice and warm here at Alameda Gardens, but when we walked from Marina Bay in Ocean Village, it was a little bit chilly, like really blowy. So we have our coats with us. <laughs> but when we get here, it's different, absolutely different weather in here. Yeah. So, um, well, today we started our day walking actually on the main street. We went into the uh, immigration office where I collected my residency card, which was ready, but it is still the same blue card. So I just renewed my uh, blue card for another one for five years. And I'm still waiting for my permanent residency, guys. Yes, it is still not ready. I didn't pop in to ask because last time when I came in and asked them, they told me I need to contact them through the email with the person who collected my documents. And that person is not answering for probably about two weeks because that's exactly two weeks ago I went to uh, immigration to renew the blue card so um, I'm going to try to maybe call them and ask what is going on because it's been now like uh, nearly eight months I think it is yeah so it's been it takes long very long so I'm not really happy about it <laughs> because I need my red card you know to go to Spain <laughs> that's the only what I needed for uh because yes first it's a permanent residency and then you have to apply for red card imagine so it would need to wait another two weeks after they will give me the permanent residency so it's all uh i don't know why it takes so long i don't know they're not answering why does it take so long but that's the reality guys so yeah and uh the plan is walk around um, and enjoy lovely weather here at alameda gardens really nice birds isn't it sounds really nice and then we are going to go for lunch and continue a bit more walking and then uh, back home so that's the plan um. <laughs> for today <laughs> okay so this is very nice and pretty spot from here everything is uh, green and flowers are blossom yeah and uh, well this education zone is still closed so I don't know if they ever opened it before because it kind of looks like definitely locked. And I don't know why also it takes them so long. I don't remember last time I went here, it was still looking like this. Maybe it's certain hours, but there is no information, absolutely nothing um, when it opens. So uh, yeah, I was hoping that we would come here today and would be able to actually go into this because it is something new here for Alameda but unfortunately it's still closed yeah well maybe next time next year <laughs> I don't know you could never be certain here in Gibraltar they uh, finish when they finish the days so uh, yeah Alameda look how pretty it is and it is empty who said that Gibraltar is overcrowded you can't really judge by one street only main street because otherwise it's it's quite empty i mean look it's a working day today yep everyone is probably at offices uh, in business district yeah <laughs> where we went yesterday <laughs> but here at alameda gardens no people very very quiet so it is the place when you if you need to enjoy some greenery and quiet times here in Gibraltar, then you can come over here, guys. Yeah. Well, I mean, we still have uh, spring and some trees have no leaves, but uh, the rest are. This is really nice. I like this also view from here. But we also came here to have a look what the flowers they have in this time of the year in April what um, what the flowers oh they those I like those ones like little bells Let's see yeah it should be every month I think it should be different flowers look pretty isn't it that's another one of uh, my favorite bottle brush <laughs> yes it is isn't it it's really pretty right now look how bright it is isn't it it does look quite happy here mm. very nice so 
some more flowers in here. Yeah. Okay, I have noticed this cactus right in the middle. I honestly don't remember. Was it there before or not? <laughs> Can someone remind me? <laughs> I've been here a long time ago and I don't remember seeing it. I think it's new. <laughs> it's standing here on its own alone, poor thing. really nice here nice to relax here I know that uh, you can do some yoga there I have some people getting here for some classes I'll presume they will be doing it right here but they're doing it so early you just I can't really it's about nine o'clock or something or maybe even earlier I mean, it would be really nice to do some exercises here because it's just but probably Oh, look, I have just found someone's, I don't know, what is this driving license? I'm not going to, I don't want to turn it around to show because if it's someone's name, but I'm going to see and uh, try it. I probably would have to take it to police office. Okay, so we decided to wait a little bit here just in case maybe the owner of this driving license will be back. Because, you know, sometimes you just realize that you lost it and you like coming back quickly and uh, it might be still there so we will wait and then uh, if uh, in about maybe 30 minutes we will wait if nobody comes then we are going to police office yeah so we will see okay guys so we are on the mission now <laughs> to find the owner of this driving license we waited for a little bit and it looks like nobody show up and the uh, the age of the person is quite agey, it's like uh, the guy was born in 1941, so we are kind of thinking that maybe he is from the cruise, one of the cruises. And we decided to pop into the port and ask if they can uh, find out maybe if the passenger with that name uh, on a driving license might be registered at the cruise, okay, cruise ship. So we're going to check it out, if not, then I guess, I guess we're going to go to police. <laughs> police but also of course uh, i will post it in uh, facebook page because we do have a few facebook pages for found and lost items here in gibraltar which are really really nice groups and um yeah and we will see by the way it looks there is a couple there maybe does he look like this guy actually it might be or is he no it's a bit younger isn't it we just we just see there's couple standing there maybe maybe the guy is actually the one he does look like, doesn't it, from the driving license. We're going to find out. <laughs> okay, guys, so that was uh, pure luck. We actually found the couple there, but just walking right there. Yeah, that was the guy from the driving license, and they didn't even realize that he lost it. So luckily, you see, we went <laughs> in the right direction and saw them. So, uh, yeah, they're quite happy that uh, we found it and gave them back, but they are not from the cruise. So, uh, yeah. Well, they say it saved us a trip to the port and then to the police yeah, also, now because I was re really looking forward to go for lunch now. Now we can go and uh, celebrate. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> mission they, accomplished. We <laughs> should celebrate. I know they also. Yeah, they would yeah. celebrate too. They yeah, were extremely lucky. It didn't look like it was him on the photo, but yeah, it was him. Yeah, it was. So we're glad. So yeah. yeah. Well, okay. Now we are off to. Go find somewhere to eat. Okay, 
Okay, guys, so we are having our lunch and drink Macintosh coffee. Yeah. Someone is already enjoying coffee. Yeah, we already started. <laughs> Cappuccino and I'm having a coffee with me. So we are waiting for our lunch. Okay, here we have, this is huevos rotos. One of my favorite dishes. And this is Lina's African roll, is it? Mm -hmm. You have here chicken, isn't it? Mm -hmm. And some spices in it, and I think it's cheese. Yep. Onion. Oh, it's onion. Mm -hmm. Okay. Bon Bon appetit. <laughs> Gibraltar. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and we will see you next time. Bye, Thank everyone. You. Bye bye.